Hey there, Joey from DayJobHacks.com. Today I'm starting a new series of videos on how to make $100 a day. Today's strategy is going to be around AdSense. I'm going to show actual examples of me making this much money with AdSense. You're going to see that over the course of the last year, I've averaged about $4,000 per month with AdSense. So I'm gonna show you inside how it works, why I think this is a good strategy for some people to focus on, and why did I choose $100 a day as the number? Well, the reason I chose $100 a day is because a lot of people who start out with marketing online or trying to make money online like that number. The $100 a day profit is one of those places that once you hit it, you can start scaling and taking that to the next level of $1,000 a day, $5,000 a day, whatever it is you're looking to make, okay? Now, I wanna use actual examples of what I do, so I'm not giving you some fluffy theories that I've read online or some strategies that don't work. We're gonna go into my computer, we're gonna see the data, and I know people that watch this channel really like that kind of stuff. So if you like to see data, you like to see money being earned, please like this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I do tons of videos like this and there's going to be plenty more on this topic of the $100 a day series where I'm gonna start really showing you some stuff on how to actually do it and what I'm actually doing, okay? So let's do that right now. Okay, I'm gonna try and rifle through this video quickly so I'm not rambling on. Google AdSense is a product that Google owns. You can sign up for free and you can start earning money from Google AdSense as long as you have a decent website online and you create content for your website. And here's an example of content, what I mean here. This is where I create content online and I have multiple different niche websites. This is just an example, day job hacks. And you can see that on this website, I create blog posts. And on the blog posts, you can see that there are advertisements for other products. And this is brought to you by Google AdSense. I've installed a plugin on my website. Now, if you are completely new to this, you have no idea what I'm talking about, go to powerhouseaffiliate.com slash action dash plan. It's going to tell you how to set up a website. Also check out our free training at Powerhouse Affiliate on how to create websites and content online so that you can start monetizing the traffic. Today's video, I'm talking about monetizing that traffic with Google AdSense. And I'm showing you here that I am actually, in fact, earning more than $100 a day Canadian from AdSense alone. I'm earning roughly $100 US, we'll say, per day from traffic that I am not paying for, okay? So technically it's free traffic, but it's not because there's a lot of work involved. This isn't a free scammy little method on how to siphon money out of AdSense, okay? It takes work, it takes content, and you need to be able to do that. So um, just for fun, I did a quick search on how much the average Canadian earns per year. Uh, you can see here roughly uh, $4,200 a month. So showing here that one person can easily do the same thing with Google AdSense and just doing content marketing online, okay? Um, kind of showing you the, the reality of what can be done here with just effort every single week. So how did I do it? How am I doing this? And what are other people doing with AdSense? Which is creating content online, getting people to that content, and you know it's delivering actual ads within the content that doesn't look completely scammy and every now and then you know it pops in a little advertisement here and i make money from these types of ads okay so if somebody clicks on this ad i earn money so how much money would i earn from dayjobhacks.com let me show you precisely what that is here's dayjob hacks now you can see this isn't magical revenue from dayjob hacks so this is just one example i'm going to show you the math involved so you understand how much work is involved if you want to do the content marketing strategy and earn money a hundred dollars a day from AdSense okay here you can see roughly how much revenue this site made in the last 30 days so only $17 uh, uh, then that's over 30 days now this is just one example I'm gonna show you another example here in a second so don't worry um, but I'm just showing you the math here so you can see that it's all based on the revenue per thousand sessions or revenue per thousand people that are looking at your content, whatever you want to do here, okay? But you can see here that the revenue per thousand is roughly $51. And this is broken down, by the way, on each page. So you can see all the pages over here. And each page has a different revenue per thousand sessions because some of these 
trigger different types of ads, okay? So you can actually, you can change how much your revenue per thousand sessions is by focusing your content on certain niche topics or certain topics in general that would result in higher um, earnings, okay? So it's just a matter of testing, finding which piece of content is earning the most per thousand views, and then perhaps creating more content similar to that so that you can start getting higher earnings per thousand sessions, okay? So here you can see it ranges from $51 all the way down to, I guess, four cents for a thousand sessions. So this is just one topic that's not triggering a lot of great ads. But again, this is really small data because this is a brand new site. I created it for the channel and it was used as an example, but you can see it is getting traffic and most of this traffic is free or it's coming from emails that we send out to people. But most of it is actually 100, well, all of it is free traffic technically because it's coming from either YouTube or search engines or emails that we send out to people because I've built lists in this niche, okay? So let me show you another example. Here you can see that the revenue here is a little higher per thousand sessions. So how am I getting, holy, here's one, $2,400 per thousand sessions. Like, this is crazy. Now, maybe with more traffic, it wouldn't be as high, but still you can see on average, the average that I'm earning per thousand is way higher than the make money online niche. Now, how do you know which niche to go into that has the higher sessions? or pay, uh, sorry, the higher revenue per thousand sessions. Well, you need to do some research on, you know, the top um, competitive niches for Google ads themselves, okay? So I'm in a niche here where I'm getting a ton of traffic to a high competitive niche. And what I can tell you is that this type of traffic is generally in the financial niche, okay? So I'm talking like home, do it yourself, um, save money, insurance, all of those things are uh, high competitive niches where you can get traffic on a front end offer and monetize it with CPA affiliate offers while building a list while also creating content. And I've explained this entire setup and theory in a webinar, in a, a, I think it's like an hour and 20 minute webinar inside Powerhouse Affiliate premium members area. Go to powerhouseaffiliate.com, sign up, go into the premium webinars and you're gonna see this ex exact strategy step by step by step on how I've done this with high competitive niches and built front end offers as an affiliate, built a list and then I get traffic to my blog afterwards after somebody has already either purchased a product or subscribed to the list. It's a very simple strategy all in here. I'm not gonna go through it again, but you can see it is in fact working. It's doing quite well um, and it's consistent. So it's something that you can do yourself. So let me assume this is something you might want to explore. So how do you go about it? What are the step-by-step -step procedures? Let me go over that really fast here, okay? So here's an example, which I said, dayjobhacks.com. You can see I built a website, okay? First of all, you need to come up with an idea. You need content. You need to be able to create content in your niche of choice. In this case, I picked Make Money Online. As you can see, it doesn't make a lot of money from AdSense because I think that Google Ads blocks certain ads from showing on sites like this because it's all about make money online, which is one of those topics that you want to avoid, I think, if you're going into AdSense. You want to find high competitive niches, but at the same time, fully compliant niches with Google ads themselves. So if you were to try and buy ads on Google ads, um, search ads or display ads or YouTube ads or whatever it is, you want one that's uh, going to be 100% compliant. So for example, do it yourself, home improvement, all of that stuff are high payout um, niches in AdSense that are going to work for you. The next step I've done here is I've created a squeeze page, a way of capturing emails. Again, I explained that in the webinar, but we get traffic to the main page here. We collect the email and once people enter their email, they are now on our list. We can start sending them all the time. Every time we create new content on our website, we can send them an email to that content which contains the Google AdSense code or whatever other ads you wanna use. Just again, search Google AdSense alternatives and you can find several places that do the exact same thing and you can have these ad widgets on your website, okay? 
That is one way of getting traffic through your email list. Now we're also getting traffic from our search engine optimization. So every time we post new content, people are coming to the website. There is a course in my link description below that I highly recommend you check out on how to get tons of traffic from search engine optimization. Again, I'm not gonna get into that here. Now another way we're getting traffic to these pages is when we give away our freebies. So if I create a freebie here, um, sometimes we send people directly to a page with AdSense after we've collected the email, okay? So you're getting more traffic that way. So here in, it's almost like arbitrage, but at the same time we're, connect, we're connecting with people, we're getting their email, we're building a business, we're building uh, assets while at the same time earning from Google AdSense. To bring it all into perspective here on how much work it's going to actually take you to do this, it really comes down to how much earnings you're going to earn per thousand sessions and how hard it is to get that many sessions in whatever niche you choose. So in this case, like I said, I chose a high competitive niche, but I am monetizing the front end traffic with paid traffic while collecting emails and converting those emails profitably on the front end using CPA affiliate offers. And now the amount of sessions I need to, to get in order to make $100 a day is dramatically decreased because here you can see that I'm earning roughly $50 per thousand sessions, okay? So if I'm earning roughly $50 on average, some of these sites have obviously more. So if I can send more traffic to pages like this from my email list, this is where I'm deciding what content I'm sending to my email list, okay? So that I can get more bang for my buck from my email list. That's how you can factor in how much money you could potentially earn from an email list based on how many messages you send out. So when I said that earlier, we had, I don't know if I mentioned it in this video or not, but I, we had one email list where we started sending way too many messages. We were sending like one a day. Uh, what happened was it got blocked by the spam bots because we were sending too many messages. So you really have to balance how many messages you're sending out to try and get your page views because what you're trying to do is obviously increase your page views while at the same time keeping your earnings per uh, thousand views high. So hopefully this has been a very good eye opener on how much work is involved, how much, what the math is behind AdSense, why it's possible to arbitrage AdSense. And also if you're going to get into this business, make sure you look for AdSense alternatives because sometimes um, AdSense is a little more strict than others like Outbrain or Taboola or any other of those ad platforms that you can use to monetize your website traffic. If you have any questions, please post them down below. If you have comments or anything that you think I left out, um, go ahead and comment below.